I'm in my dome, sliding through a lot of dell. Squad of Hey, what's going on, man? It's your boy 2JZDunk.com. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, a lot of questions on why I started the business, why I start, went, decided on going mobile. I just figured, like, you know, it'd be best if I can pull up at somebody's crib at their own comfort and do the job there versus them coming into the rim shop or dropping their car to the rim shop. Everybody around their car. Everybody know what you got going on. So I figured I'm gonna go mobile. And then on top of that, I don't like overhead. Overhead, your bills times two. I ain't on that. So I figured, that's too hot. <laughs> so I figured, um, all right, I'm gonna get the bus, insurance. I ain't gotta pay all them extra fees. So I went ahead and went mobile. At first I was in a box truck claustrophobic I needed windows so everybody wanted to see the inside so this over here I'm gonna change up a little bit with a TV and go I gotta go to Tito let him handle that but as you can see a little waiting area work area. I try to keep it clean as possible so I can move around and I can have everything that I use on a daily day on a day to day basis. So so the tire machine. This is a, the older Auto 34. This is the older version. I can only do 17 and up on this machine. I want to upgrade it but as I go along make some cheese I'll get a different one so I can do as small as 13s and up, and then I'll be fine. Um, with this machine, I had to notch the top. I'm gonna clean it up, it's not finished yet. Everything is a work in process. I had to go up, and I just went ahead and put a sunroof on it at the same time. So we can have, you know, good lighting. This is my balancer from Hunter. This is a good machine. I try to keep it as clean as possible. And with this one, I'm gonna change this screen and I'm gonna have it off the TV in the front. So everything that I do can show on the TV and also with movies, etc. This bus I'm gonna keep later on. If you guys know me, I'm crazy. I might put a, I'm gonna put a diesel in there, put a Cummins in it and change the turbo just cause. Second truck is on the way. I'll be looking for one right now as we speak. Um, wheels. These are 24s off a of semi that I got polished. I only have four of them. The inside wheel is the factory wheel with the LT tire so we can support the weight. If, you know, anybody was wondering how is he on them skinnies? Every day like that. Um, the pump is under here. I had to improvise. I ain't want all this stuff in the bus. There's other tire trucks that have their generator and stuff inside. I hate noise. So, got the electric motor for the pump. I didn't show y'all the breaker box. The breaker box is behind Bob Molly. And the generator is on the other side. I have a hose reel, but my hose is too long, so I gotta wrap it over here. This is temporary. It used to go through the bus. This is the generator. It takes propane also. And that's welded to the bus. Everything's welded to the bus. My air tank. 
my air tank is from here to here. I cut out the frame and we notched the frame. Pushed the air tank all the way up, welded brackets and welded it to the bus. So on the box truck before it was visible, on this is not, which is perfect. So it works out good for me, man. I like this bus. So we got the lighting also. I'm gonna add more to the back and the other side. And these these windows, they go up. So I'm gonna put it on um, a shock so I can open it and it'll stay up if I don't feel like keeping the AC on. So, you know, it's all about custom. I love custom things. I love messing with all types of vehicles. You got something else coming crazy. I'm not gonna say anything about it because I don't wanna see it being done. Just know, we trying to take over stuff, so. 2jzdunk.com, man, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. To all my subscribers, I appreciate y'all. Thanks for the love. I highly appreciate it, man. That's right. Hey, and shouts out to everybody that, you know, that's messing with the business that allow me to come to their residence and work on their vehicles, people that trust me, you know what I'm saying? Wherever I go, it's disclosed, you know what I'm saying? So. I appreciate that. Um, more about this artwork and what it inspires and what it means. I'm from Lauderdale. I'm a Lauderdale baby. This is sunrise and 31st, if you was wondering. Over here, this is coming down 31st and busting the U-turn. This is the Exxon gas station, which is a hangout at night. This is, this is where everybody go and get those viral pictures. So, you know, I got 250 Slim coming up the street, burning rubber, because that's what it's about, man. You know, tap the gas. You got to show them that, you know, you ain't got no cheap motor, man. We got my boy coming out the gas station on them Daytons. Daytons. Big hubs. He candy. He coming out the gas station. That's my boy from Hollywood. We got old coon coming up the street. You know, Jughead did the inside, so we know we had to go ahead and, <laughs> you know? That's what, you know, that's the scene. It's the whole scene. Everything coming up, Sunrise, Swap Shop. This is Swap Shop, but you know, it's Tito's Sound. That's why we go there, so. You'll know, that's Tito's. You see it right here, too. Tito's Sound, man. Over everything right now. That's just, you know, that's what I mess with. That's, that's who I choose. Everybody, you can go whoever you want, but I go to Tito's Sound for everything. So, that's how it goes. And for anybody that's wondering about my contact info, it's on the bus. It should be on the page if you can't find it. It's 786-570-5400. Shout out the Tribute Capital for business funding with my truck. They helped me get funding for my truck. Big shout outs to them. Um, hit them up for all your needs, financial needs with any business or any, any financial things that you might need help with. Talk about how to build your business and personal credit in 30 days, assistance with getting business grants, and assistance with trying to apply for jobs in person or remote. Are you ready? Come on.